Hurricane Helene lashing parts of Cuba and Mexico's Yucatan Peninsula Wednesday. Heavy rainfall flooded parts of Cancun and the surrounding areas, plunging vehicles underwater. The powerful ocean waves pounded the coastline. Strong winds from the storm also knocking out power to thousands of people in Cuba's western province. CNN's Patrick Ottman reports from Havana. The worst of Hurricane Helene appears to have passed through Cuba, but for much of the day of Wednesday, uh, this uh, part of the island, the westernmost and even central parts of Cuba were rocked by uh, heavy winds and rain uh, flooding in western Cuba. It still has some towns cut off. According to officials there, about 50,000 people in the westernmost Cuban province of Pinar del Rio are still without power, and it could take days uh, for electricity to be restored there. All the same, though, many Cubans felt they missed the worst of this powerful hurricane. It did not make uh, a direct hit on Cuba as it uh, traveled between the Yucatan Peninsula in Mexico and westernmost Cuba. It does not appear, though, that uh, Florida is going to be as lucky. The panhandle or, or western part of Florida are looking uh, to be hit by uh, a powerful category for hurricane. That is what forecasters are saying that Helene could strengthen into. And that is the kind of hurricane that can bring absolutely devastating storm surge uh, to coastal areas, uh, can knock out power for weeks, take down uh, heavy trees and power lines. So residents are being urged uh, to take final preparations as a storm much more powerful than the one hit Cuba uh, takes aim at Florida. Patrick Gottman, CNN, Havana.